lights off! It's okay. Okay, we're not dying, okay? Everything I do, I do for us. I didn't know that Dennis Quaid was just that creepy. <laughs> now, so, so, so either you, I mean, I know you're a great director. Either you really direct this, or, or is Dennis Qu Quaid really creepy? He is not creepy. that crazy, man. <laughs> he is not that crazy, I assure you. He is not. He was great, though, man. You know, um, I tell you, this movie is like a, a combination of just hope and faith all together, man. I don't know Dennis Quaid. I never met him. You know, I wrote this guy a letter, and... Um, he responded to my letter. It was like, right. yo, I want to talk to you. Got on the phone and he was like, man, first of all, the, the, the letter moved me. He's like, number two, tell me who you are. And I'm like, I'm Dion, I'm just, you know, I'm black filmmaker, man, I'm trying to do my own thing. And he said, I love the script. And he was like, what are we doing? And when he said, what are we doing? I said, we? <laughs> Mr. Quaid, did you say we? <laughs> and um, he came in and when he came to set, I tell you why he's a true movie star. He came to set and said, you're the director, you tell me what you want me to do, and I'm gonna give you everything I have. There was no, I'm, this is a real story, there was no, ah, let me see what you got. You, none of that, because I've been on sets where you, yeah. you have to, someone has to take some three days and be like, oh, I guess he know what he doing. Yeah, yeah. This was like, no, I'm here for you, what are we doing? And he was like, I'm gonna try some things, and you're gonna be like, I went too far. Yeah. <laughs> he was like, just tell me when. Yeah. And when you come with that attitude, man, it just shot the movie to me to the moon. Because wow. now you got, he's the heart. Yeah. You know what I mean? He, yeah. It's beating. When you go to the movie and you watch it, you're like, yo, this dude is crazy. Yeah. And what's fun about the film is it goes from laughing, oh, ha, 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 look at it, oh, they're so silly, to where you're like, yo, when <laughs> just, where exactly. do we go? You exactly. know. And I thought that's was the, the brilliance of the movie. Exactly, yeah. exactly. So, so, like, when you look at your IMDb, like, you're in development production. It's like three pages of, <laughs> of stuff. So, like, when you have all these projects back to back, has it sharpened you as a producer, writer, and director, like, to have them go? Yeah, it, it, um, well, first of all, what, what's great about, you know, wasn't always so great. Everyone, it was really people looking at me like, yo, you tripping. I didn't want to ever be put in a box as a filmmaker. Mm -hmm. You know, I feel like there's a world where if you think of, and, and these are greats, if you think of John Singleton, you know, you understand what movie he makes, Spike Lee, what movie he makes. I come from a different world, man. Like, I come from the projects of Gary, Indiana, you know what I mean, where yeah. I loved all the movies. I can give you all the lines to life, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. All the way across the board to uh, Psycho or Predator. So I just love all genres. So when I created myself into a filmmaker, one of the things that I always wanted to do is make whatever movie I wanted to make. Yeah. And it was interesting, man, being black in Hollywood, that's not something that they, they, they don't like that. You know what yeah, I mean? Like, yeah. well, what do you yeah. do? I said, I'll do this, i do this. And at first it was like, what are you talking about? And we broke that barrier. Yeah. You know, I love comedy, so I want to make comedy. I love thrillers and want to make a thriller. And now, yeah, you're right. Now, IMDb, you see all the stuff we're developing. You're like, yo, what yeah. is going on over there? Yeah. Like, we looking at, you know, we're treating film, you know, like mixtapes. We're like, yo, this is dope. You know what I mean? Let's, let's drop this one and make it that way and build it that way and make sure we got our stamp on it and put it out there to the people, man. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Because I felt like, you know, even with the passing of Nip recently, Right, you watch how much music gonna come out because he was an independent artist. It wasn't about let me sit back in. No man, he's in the streets. He's like, yo, that's dope. Let's go. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And for me, I'm like, man, I got that same energy. Like, man, make them. Don't yeah. sit around and talk about it. Let's go. Let's make them and let's make them great. Yeah. You know. Yeah. So that's my, you know, my energy towards that. You know what yeah. I mean? People are like, yeah, we are developing because I don't want to stop. I want to go, man. You know. You don't never know when you'll be the last time making a movie. Yeah. You know, seriously. Well, I mean, you keep on doing it. I, I know we 
a little bit over time, but I gotta ask you, you are a real basketball player. Yeah, I really do that. Can you, can you still drop like 25 or, or oh, something? Anybody. anybody. See that dude over there behind the camera? Yeah. That's my boy, it's Omar. I give him 30 in front of y'all. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, no I, really, I hoop, man. You know, and, and I tell you this, man, my, my pops recently died and he, uh, I would take him with me to the gym. He was like really in shape and and he told me one day, because I was I still play as much as I can. He looked at me one day, the funniest dude, and he was like, Let me tell you something, man. Don't ever stop. And I was like, he was like, when you stop, it's gonna like, it's gonna be over. So I was like, what do you mean? And it took me a year after his death to be like, oh, I know what he means, because I ran to this old dude that was like, yo, don't ever stop, man, because when you stop. So I hoop all the time now, and I'm it's weird because I'm out there and this guy's, you know. 16, 17, like, yo, you still got it. I said, yeah, man, I, I, we know how to do this. And it's great, man. It's, it's actually my sanctuary. Yeah. So yeah. when you see all the stuff we're doing, I think basketball to me, man, it's where you you don't have to think. It's yeah. just a sport. I love it, man. I love it. Thank you, brother. Thank you, man. Appreciate you, man. And thank you so much.